I don't really drink beer at all. I usually drink Heineken, Tiger. I usually drink just like sweet beers. I only drink sweet beers. Real men drink sweet beers. I'm very, 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 very confident in my sexuality. Banana beer! Okay. Oh, cute! Long ago, ale was known as liquid bread. It's beer coming out of a banana. Is that why monkeys are always kind of drunk? To awaken the senses. It literally smells like banana, banana cake. Take a deep breath, there's a little bit of monkey business. <laughs> It reminds me of my childhood when my mom and I used to bake banana cake. That's so sad, you don't bake it anymore. <laughs> I like beers that generate this colour a little bit heavier. It looks like it's got a bit of flavour. Cheers. Cheers. Oh wow, it tastes good. I was actually expecting to taste banana bread. No, the, the smell, smell is, is stronger, stronger than the taste. taste. The banana is kind of the aftertaste. It's also light. It's slightly bitter. This might be my favourite beer yet. But it's very smooth, very drinkable, actually. I'm just drinking, <laughs> like I'm just gonna finish this. Beaver Town Gamma Ray American Pale Ale. Wow. Pew pew pew! So cute. so cute! This packaging is, I think, the best I've seen in all beers. It's like graffiti art, right? Yeah, it, it is. Can. It is. Are we still on Earth? <laughs> it's liquid gold. It's a gold. Yeah, it's liquid gold, gold man. Oh. It's sweet but sour as well. Uh, I don't know. I don't like Why? It. it smells good. It's very fruity. Wow. It smells like a fruit, but I can't mm. put my finger on which fruit. I smell peach, but I taste. God. The name doesn't give anything away. Oh, I think it's a hit. It's like, yeah. this is gonna be a badass beer! It's and like, then it's all yeah. fruity! What if when we finish drinking this, we start turning green? I would buy it for the can and then I would give it away. We were looking at the markings on the back of the can. Nobody cares about the content, look at the packaging! We've got pants minus one, which we probably think after drinking one of these, you should probably take enough uh, item of clothing. Taking you downtown to Beaver Town. <laughs> Beaver Town. It's kind of taller than the regular beer. Who this is the height of the beer bottle. Me, because I'm short, okay? <laughs> nice colour, bit cloudy. I don't really smell the berries though. Mm. I don't really actually get anything from yeah. this. It smells like my dog's pee. <laughs> Whoa! Nice. It's sour. It's very sour. Yeah, it has a, the most jarring taste. Almost like vinegar, right? Mm. Not bad. It makes the tongue kind of go, yeah, it just go dry. It tastes a bit like... White wine. It kind of tastes like Ravina that you left in the fridge for the longest time. Yellow belly. <laughs> this is so wrong, this packaging. Yellow belly. Ah, wait, is this supposed we... to be a joke on the KKK? Because it's not funny. Ku Klux Klan, isn't yeah, it really? Yeah, the eyes. <laughs> when I first saw this, I thought it was like Casper, the friendly ghost. Or is this supposed to be like a little ghost? But apparently it's KKK, the unfriendly American. Racist beer. Once I open it, what are you hit with? You are hit with a poem. Yellow Belly is a person who is without courage, fortitude or nerve. A coward. Aww. To us, one of the most cowardly deeds is to act anonymously. Hiding behind a group. <gasps> a signifying trait of institutionalised racism. Oh my god, words of wisdom. From the bottle. <laughs> this beer is brewed to celebrate all things new, open-minded and progressive. A peanut butter biscuit start with no biscuits, butter or nuts. Taste, enjoy and don't be prejudiced. Wow. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> so we gotta drink this with like no judgment. Don't be peanut butter yeah. and prejudice. Yeah. And biscuits. I think that's kind of clever. Now I know why it's so rare. A meaningful beer. Yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. Why would you not want to drink it? How's... Smells like... It smells great. It smells awesome. Whoa, whoa. Wow. It smells exactly like peanut butter. It smells like Skippy's peanut butter. Reese's peanut butter biscuits. I'm not really a big fan of stout or porter or anything like that, but it smells really good. <gasps> it is so dark. It's like oil. It's a heavier beer. It is. It's kind of like bitter, but not very bitter. What do you mean? It's very smooth on the tongue, goes down very smoothly. It's really, really nice. I thought it would taste better. It's like Christmas in a cup. If you are allergic to peanuts and you would like to try something that has peanut flavour, you can officially try this beer. It's a beer to be appreciated as opposed to drunk, I think. I have a new profound um, respect for people who do craft beers. It's really interesting to know that there's many different flavours of beers. I kind of like craft beer now. Like, I feel that it's an acquired taste that I have acquired. <laughs> <laughs> I want to try more, but I don't know where to do that. <laughs> Someone needs to tell me like now. <laughs> You can actually go to Beer Bash on the 16th of January. If you drink, don't drive. If you drive, don't drink. If you drive, you're an idiot. <laughs>